Hey there, Selly Squad, and welcome back to Selly's Kitty Haven. Join me in my brand new series just for my teachers out there called Dear Teacher. Here are five ways to be a fun teacher. Let's get right into it. Growing up, we all have that one teacher. You know, the one that will walk into a classroom and everybody will turn into a statue. They'd say things like, no talking, no laughing, another test, silly question, what's so funny, get out of my class. How did such teachers make you feel? And then there were those that looked like this and they'll constantly remind you of their gazillion years of experience. There was no bond between teacher and student. One thing is for sure, they all had the fear of being disrespected. The question becomes, how do we make sure we don't end up like them? There are ways to make sure that children love and enjoy your lessons without you compromising yourself. So, how do we do that? Firstly, don't take yourself or your subject too seriously. Yep, I know this one is controversial, but the truth is, students tend to hate your subject the more you keep going on about, if you don't study, I will fail you. What you'd rather want to do is spend more time showing interest in how they're faring in other subjects. Encourage them when you see them in the hallway. Ask them if there are ways you can support them to do as well as they're doing in your subject. That way, they end up liking you and your subject even more. Participate in projects. Oftentimes, as teachers, when we give out projects, we end up standing on the sides and watching children get them done. You would rather want to get involved. Touch things, feel things, explore and discover things with the children. That way, you tell them you care about them and so should they. When children see you making mistakes and discovering with them, they tend to be more involved and take your projects seriously. Incorporate mystery into your lessons. When you're teaching, make sure to ask the right questions. Ask unique questions that will spark up a lot of thinking and bring out amazing ideas in your lessons. When children think, you would want them to think big. You would want them to be left wanting more and asking themselves what's going to happen next. Enjoy yourself and don't be scared to get your hands dirty. As teachers, we think way too much about how people see us. Though your reputation is important, please loosen up sometimes. If it means showing up dressed up as the king from the storybook they're treating, or coming in as the clown to lighting up the day for your little ones, or being that superhero to help them in their difficult math problems. Whichever way, add some zazz and bizarre to your lessons. Get creative. Losing up, teacher. Last but not the least, show learners that you care. When you teach, you would want to study the atmosphere. Look out for gestures, body language, attitudes, and changing moods. Let learners know that you're there for them. Let them feel your love from a mile away. Get closer to them. Inspire them, mentor them, and be there for them. When it's all said and done, it's not just about the academic performance. It's the total upbringing of the child. So, show that you care. Dear teacher, you have no idea of how much of an impact you have on these little hearts. So please never dull your shine. 
You might be the reason why they look forward to coming to school. Be fun, let loose, and show them that you care because they truly care about you. Thank you for watching and join me in the next one. Toodles! La, la, la.